feel like with ICS, there's technology literally everywhere. You can pick, I feel like if you said anything, I could be like, oh, well, here's the computers and that. So, um, you know, ICS, it gives you coverage in so many areas that you really can't go wrong, you know, regardless, because of the way the world is shaping now with technology. It's just such a, a, a safe major. Um, so if you're interested in it, I would definitely pick it and excel because it's gonna be around for a long time. My name is Jared Heron. I'm a third year computer science and engineering major. And I just always knew from when I was little, I liked computers. I always, uh, you know, worked on the computer. Um, video games, of course, is, is like a huge part of it that gets students into it. But I, I just knew going in, I was like, I need to do computers. So picking school of ICS was easy. It was just a matter of picking the major inside. And so when I found out about CSE, it's like, oh, they do hardware and software. So it's not even picking, it's both together. And all software and hardware is integrated all the time. So it seemed to just cover all the bases and I figured it would make me pretty versatile when I graduated. So obviously in addition to ICS and then you know my position here in Middle Earth with undergraduate housing, we throw events here all the time. There's uh, UCI zone having different things with things ASUCI and uh, you know different career things going on for students. Um, in addition to that, you know UCI sporting events. We have a top baseball team, top men's volleyball team. The sporting events are awesome. Me and my friends always go out to those, yell our heads off, get the get our Eater Nation shirts on, get our Zod Zod on. So uh, I, I would really encourage more students to to go out to that because uh, the energy level is awesome when the when the building's packed. The School of ICS, I think, does a good job in giving you just a little bit of everything where you would be able to teach yourself something in the future. I feel like I've seen stuff now where I used to be like, what is that? Now I look at it and I'm like, hey, like I recognize that and I can you know, go with what I, what I know to um, feel my way through um, certain things. I did have one internship with uh, Canon Development Americas. It's a research and development uh, part of Canon, the camera company. What I did is they were trying to come out with an HD TV and um, they wanted to create, you know, a good user interface, obviously. And I had to create a document, it ended up being like 70 pages for, for each one of just the, the UI, like the flow. And it was a good experience working in the industry and I had a good supervisor and just those connections, I think will help me sometime in the future. In fact, I would say that internship definitely changed my mindset of um, you know why I was in computer science. Some people don't play video games. So if I can appeal to a wider audience by working on a project, that seems really interesting to me. So that's what made me think, oh, you know, I don't have to work on video games. This major, I can do anything. There's technology with computers everywhere. So I could, um, you know, work on making a new TV, that technology, or the mobile world. It just made me realize that technology really is everywhere. And with a computer science engineering major, where you have hardware and software, you can apply it to literally like any field at all. <laughs>